chapter 17, Mishnah 3. This Mishnah lists several cases in which a field does not become a base of pros, even though it contains a grave that was plowed over. If someone plows over a pit containing several corpses, or he plows through a pile of human bones that are lying exposed on the ground, the field is tahor. Since these are unusual cases, the rabbis did not apply the decree of Beis Hapras to them. The next case involves a field in which a grave was lost. That is, we know that the field contains a grave, but we do not know where in the field it is. The whole field is considered a Beis Hapras and is Tame, even if it was not plowed, as we will learn in Mishnah 5 and Mishnah, um, cha in, in chapter 18, Mishnah 3. The Mishnah discusses a person who plows from that field into another field. Someone plowed from a field in which a grave was lost to a different field, even though he might have plowed through the grave and carried bone fragments to the second field. The second field does not become a base of pros, because there are two levels of doubt here. He might not have plowed through the grave, and even if he did, the plow might not have scattered any pieces. The rabbis did not decree Tuma for such a remote, a remote doubt more cases. Or if someone plowed through a field that was not known to contain a grave, but after it was plowed, a grave was found in it. The field does not become a base of pros. The decree of base of pros is a stringency that the rabbis decreed as a penalty for plowing a grave. Since in this case, the person did not know that he was plowing a grave, the rabbis did not penalize him by making the field tame. Similarly, if someone plows over a grave in a field that is not his property, the field does not become tame. Here too, a penalty is not relevant since the owner of the field, who would suffer if the field became Tame, did nothing wrong. A final case. Similarly, if, non, if a non-Jew plows over a grave in his own field, he does not make it a base of pros, because the decree of base of pros does not apply even to Kuthians, a, notion, a nation that converted to Judaism, but did not observe the mitzvahs properly. And it certainly does not apply to non-Jews.